Hello everyone, I'm Richard Branch, Chief Economist for Dodge Construction Network, and I'm here today to talk about the Construction Starts news release for February 2023. Now the data that we're talking about today represents the summation of all construction projects that broke ground during the month, in this case, February 2023. And we put the full dollar value of that construction project in the month in which it broke ground. So kind of a mixed bag in uh, construction starts for uh, February 2023. Total construction starts were up 6% from uh, January. On the surface, that would seem like a, a decent number. But underneath here, uh, several things going on. We'll start with non-residential buildings. Non-residential buildings up 9% in the month. Uh, but that was really due to the start of yet another mega manufacturing project, this time an EV battery plant in Ohio. You remove that project and you look at commercial construction or institutional construction starts, and they were both fairly weak. Non-building construction was also down 5% in the month. But I think the interesting part of this, the, the data as we looked at it in February was residential buildings. Residential buildings increased 11% in February with both single family as well as multifamily climbing, not just in dollar value, but in units as well. So from single family's perspective, this was the first month to month increase in units breaking ground in over a year. So we've been thinking that we're pretty near the bottom of the, the single family market and that we're coming up on an inflection point is or was february that inflection point i think still a little too early to tell one month does not a trend make um but certainly i think uh it, it's just another indicator to us that we are near the bottom of the single family market so as we think about how we're, we're looking ahead here into 2023 we're still thinking here that that the, the 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 economic woes that the country will face in 2023 will certainly be a weight on commercial and institutional construction starts throughout the year. However, we should start to see the seeds of recovery in residential and single family construction this year. And we also think that public dollars propping up the, the manufacturing space as well as infrastructure will on balance keep uh, construction activity in 2023 fairly level. So we'll keep it there for now. Thanks very much for watching and we'll talk to you real soon.